soft skills soft skills are an essential skills which are never taught in school and colleges and in fact which is need of the art when someone finishes his or her college and jumps into the job market then most of the organizations give preferences to soft skills over hard skills uh, while hiring their candidates hello my name is hs negi and today i am going to address a very important topic called soft skills what is the importance of soft skills which i am going to uh, cover today uh, so here we go actually soft skills are personal attributes which enable someone to interact effectively and harmoniously with other people soft skills are more intangible and non technical abilities that are sought from candidates for example communication team work problem solving leadership responsibility etc we will compare soft skills with hard skills so hard skills versus soft skills so what are hard skills first we will try to understand this uh, hard skills can be learned from your school and colleges whereas soft skills can't be taught in your classrooms uh, hard skills it is generally known as academic skills or technical skills whereas uh, soft skills generally known as uh, non technical skills or professional skills and hard skills can be measured through a process called evaluation whereas soft skills can't be measured but it can be observed okay uh, as far as hard skills is concerned it can help you to get an employment and soft skills it helps to accelerate your career growth uh, hard skills it defines your qualifications and soft skills it is more personality driven so today we will talk about why are soft skills important basically soft skills are the difference between adequate candidates and ideal candidates in most competitive job market recruitment criteria are not only limited to technical ability and specialist knowledge however every job role requires some interaction with others whether they are colleagues or customers uh, so soft skills are important to most employers so recruiters will be looking for people who have the potential to become leaders they won't expect you to have all the qualifications and experience from day one but they will need to know that you have qualities that will allow you to learn and grow in the role so we will discuss here the top 10 soft skills so what are the top 10 soft skills which we are going to learn today uh, uh, number 1 is communication number 2 uh, self motivation number 3 leadership number 4 responsibility number 5 team work number 6 uh, problem solving number 7 decisiveness number 8 ability to work under pressure and time management number 9 flexibility and number 10 negotiation and conflict resolution so uh, we will uh, discuss uh, these top uh, soft skills one by one so number 1 is communication so communication is one of the most important soft skills able communicators can adjust their tone and style according to their audience uh, they can effectively converse with their colleagues bosses and clients 
able communicator is also an active listener and also possesses good verbal non-verbal and written communication number 2 self motivation so having a positive attitude and the initiative to work well without around the clock supervision is a vital soft skill for any employee number 3 is leadership uh, which is very most uh, essential uh, soft skills uh, those with strong leadership skills uh, will have the ability to inspire others and lead teams to success this is why it is the this is why it is particularly sought after skill number 4 is responsibility so responsibility is a seldom talked about but highly valued soft skill uh, colleagues who fail to take responsibility for their work will be less productive and less successful overall and number 5 is team work so working in a team towards a common goal requires the intuition and interpersonal acumen so good team players are uh, perceptive as well as receptive to the needs and responsibilities of the others number 6 is problem solving so problem solving does not just require analytical creative and critical skills but a particular mindset those who can approach a problem with a cool and uh, level head will often reach a solution more efficiently than those who cannot number 7 decisiveness means decision making uh, uh, faculty so decisiveness is characterized by the ability to make quick and effective decisions a decisive employee will take effective and considered action quickly especially when under pressure number 8 ability to work under pressure and time management so many jobs come with demanding deadlines and sometimes high stakes recruiters prize candidates who show a decisive attitude and unfaltering ability to think clearly and a capacity to set stress aside and time management is also very crucial uh, soft skill uh, it is closely related to the ability to work under pressure as well as with tight deadlines employees who manage their time well can if, uh, efficiently prioritize tasks and organize their diaries while adopting an attitude which allow them to take on new tasks and deadlines number 9 is flexibility so flexibility is an important soft skill since it demonstrates and uh, and ability and willingness to embrace new tasks and new challenges calmly and without fuss number 10 negotiation and conflict resolution so this is another of those soft skills which employers look for in potential leaders to be an adept negotiator is to know how to be uh, persuasive and exert influence uh, while sensitive uh, sensitively uh, sensitively seeking a solution which will benefit all parties similarly conflict resolution depends on a strong interpersonal skills and the ability to establish a rapport with colleagues and clients along so with this uh, i'll conclude my today's topic and shortly i will come up with many more videos till then take care and thank you very much